dressing naturally without doing anything. Just dress naturally exactly as you are. That's the practice of short moments of open intelligence repeated many times until it becomes continuous. No need to do whatsoever, anything with yourself anymore. The fixing project, done. Allowing yourself to be as you are. Every, every moment as it is. And rely on the power of open intelligence to see what is of most benefit to all. So it's definitely not a passive state where we are not doing anything, not moving, relaxing, closing our eyes, or opening our eyes, or wearing uh, certain clothes, or speaking in a certain way. We are just as we are, resting naturally. And that's what I see in myself, uh, just getting mature, really, with relying on open intelligence. And coming here to open meetings, just like you come here now today, and hearing there is nothing you need to change about yourself. Everything is perfect as it is. And of course, hesitating about that and being spectacle and everything that comes with that, but remaining open to listen. And the introduction here is so very powerful, like you heard before, stop thinking for a moment. Just at the beginning, stop thinking for a moment, briefest moment ever. And what remains when you stop thinking? What remains when you stop thinking just right now? Alertness, openness, cognizance, the power to know, the power to know the next thought, the next emotion that comes. So, you see, and, and then everything comes back again, the thoughts, the emotions, and that's inseparable from open intelligence. That's inseparable from the power to know. So whether you're thinking or not thinking, open intelligence is there. Whether you're thinking or not thinking, when you, whether you're positive or negative, open intelligence is always present. Always present. It's not dependent on your state of thinking or not. So just initially, the introduction is very powerful to do, to see that open intelligence is always present. And these short moments of open intelligence, they are repeated many times to make open intelligence obvious. It's not uh, a scheduled moments where we, we hard on ourselves, we have to take a short moment, we have to take a short moment. It's whenever you remember to do so. You feel anxious, you feel angry, you feel hungry, you feel jealous or uncomfortable, you want to run away now don't want to listen to me, fine. Take a short moment of complete relaxation. Com completely relax. And then what remains? Again, open intelligence. What I see in my own experience, there is more and more stability and availability to everyone, to everything, to myself, to my family, to my husband. I'm happily married. <laughs> okay, so it's nothing is, an, uh, nothing is extreme. Of course, we are aware of everything that is happening in the world. We are aware of divorce, we are aware of the suffering, we are aware of terror. We are aware of everything. But we are open to see every moment what is of most benefit to all. And that's what I am so grateful for. To, to, to have that ability to discern what is of most benefit. To take responsibility for my actions, for my speech, for my body, mind qualities and activities, and all of that by the power of open intelligence, which is, it is natural to all of us. It's not for special people. We are all united in open intelligence. So I, I, I feel like, wow, the, the open meetings, they're every day available, and it's, um, you're welcome to come every day just to listen to different shares from trainers our own experience of how it is to allow an open intelligence and living a life of benefit, true benefit, pure benefit, where everything is seen truly for what it is, in its essence, uh, in the natural way of being, the way we, we're supposed to live. Just stay today, hang out with the community, see how people behave, speak to you, and then you see that you're just completely restful here. And then you remember short moments when you leave. 
and then just for today test it out see what it means for you to take a short moment of open intelligence and completely relax even if you don't you have no idea what it means short moment how to take it completely relax come come again please come again and 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 see how it dawns on you naturally and uh, that was for me the same so we we just by the power of open intelligence there is immediate benefit and by the power of short moments of open intelligence you you cannot hold yourself being of benefit to all you're completely available to all people even if you feel unavailable and busy there is such uh, availability and open openness to all beings and uh, what I see for myself with my family I had these comments so long before I got married about uh, when will you get married when will you have children when will you <laughs> almost every day and uh, what but it, it is good to see is uh, it's the care and the love for f of our family to us and never never diminish that you know, just saying that and acknowledging that in your speech even if it's annoying it doesn't mean anything and even when I got married it, it didn't stop <laughs> you know it's like okay the next thing is coming and it, it's just amazing and still and still and I, I just love that about my family how they're so uh, continuously caring <laughs> and and wanting the best for me and I, I love them as they are that's that's the best for me too to love the family as they are and let them be as they are it doesn't do anything to you but it's just like thank you for caring and explaining over and over again the situation and remaining open to everything not going this way or that way no marriage marriage wanting to marry everyone not wanting anyone so these extremes are not needed anymore in society it, it brought people into a state of isolation i'm not speaking definitely about you just generally speaking and then to see how when we remain open to all and then we understanding everything by the power of open intelligence we know exactly what people are going through because we let everything be as it is you see, it's such difference from trying to replace, avoid, indulge our data streams. Data streams is everything we perceive, thoughts, emotions, sensations. So I just call it, we call it in the balance view training, data, to keep it simple. So we were not trying to replace our data streams, for example, uh, anger to compassion, anger to uh, nice smile or, <laughs> or when we're not trying to indulge in stories it happened to me before my parents did that and or when we are not uh, avoiding any emotions and sensations so I don't want to hear that don't talk with me now I want to stay in my room when we just allow everything to be as it is just allow it to be as it is for short moments just completely relax for short moments the, the stories can remain that it doesn't mean anything just allow that to be as it is and what you tap into is a, a complete relaxation of mind and stability and availability and potency and power to be of benefit in every single moment so and that's what I love the most that feeling everything avoiding nothing and knowing what to do in every moment for the benefit of all like even if we don't know what to do there is complete relaxation and what you tap into by the power of open intelligence is the ease of being just uh, just easy <coughs> natural yourself being as you are finally as i am for the first time so like the context of my marriage the context of the relationship is that of benefit like living life together for the benefit of all and not focusing about my partner or how much time we have together, or romantic time, even though we, we enjoy so much together. But there is uh, such empowerment in being together. Intimacy becomes something real, not as an idea of what marriage means, what intimacy means. So that becomes exciting. I'm not trying to get you married now. <laughs> I'm just saying that, you know, open to all and, and seeing that also everything is falling into place in the right time. 
discerning when to get married, if to get married. Maybe it's not of benefit. And maybe it's of benefit in a certain time. It's, it's, it's for, for everything. The extreme of being no one, being someone. Time, no time. Mind, no mind. It's just so exhausting to try to be somewhere and to stay. You know, having no thoughts. <laughs> try that for a day. Let's see if you manage. No thoughts at all. Or remaining positive. <laughs> Remain positive today. Be positive. <laughs> <laughs> so annoying. Be positive. Life, life will be amazing. Don't worry, it probably means something in the future. Just be positive about it. Who wants to hear that when you're just completely raging? <laughs> you, you're just raging at the person who tells you to be positive. <laughs> and I'm saying that I'm in, and I'm laughing about it too because I was the one who tried so much to be positive with everything. No, not sure <laughs> like you, Lizzie, but I completely, everything was positive, positive, positive. And, and I couldn't hear people truly. And when they share, when they needed support, because immediately I couldn't bear that they feel negative. So I just tried immediately to support them, to believe that there is a meaning, there is something, just don't worry about it. It will change, just be positive. And for myself too, included, didn't want to feel sad or lonely or jealous. So just replacing, avoiding, indulging, that's what I did. Blaming others for what I feel, that made me feel better. And then coming to the training where everything is allowed to be as it is, it's such a relief, like I can be fine negative and it's totally fine. But you see, it doesn't mean anything. It doesn't mean that if I'm negative, I'm just acting in, in the way I want to act or saying things I want to say. That definitely, I will not sit here. It's, uh, it's about seeing that in every single short moment there is um, immediate benefit, natural benefit, just knowing what to do that is of most benefit. And, and there is such stability in, 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 in communicating, in, in being able to speak respectfully and also funny, you know, <laughs> not, not just like a boring person, a, a human being, a human being where we can be just natural as we are, enjoy together. Also in our dynamic where we, we tell our boyfriend to kill the cockroach or our husband. Everything allowed to be. We don't need to take it into something. A gender, a male, a naturalness. Naturalness, as it is. As it is and maybe tomorrow you will kill the cockroach. <laughs> it's, you see, it's, it's just so much fun to remain open <laughs> and, and have ideas about everything yet remaining open and always loving, not trying to be loving because that will be again annoying, <laughs> just like that, just like that. So uh, the short moments are great, very powerful, tested today and that, that's the main practice and then you have the trainer, the trainer, we are here as trainers but also many trainers are available everywhere in the world and also here with us and every day and trainers are People just share the experience of relying on open intelligence, completely dedicated to live like that. And living the Four Mainstays lifestyle, alongside with the community, participants who are completely dedicated to live like that, who demonstrate that power to be of benefit to all. If you just stay here today for lunch or dinner, you will just see that. Not trying to get you into the lunch, but maybe as well too. <laughs> and, and then it's, it's the best thing to, it's the best place to be, I must say, everywhere, but also here just to, to recognize that about yourself. And so we have the short moments, the training, the training on Saturday, t tomorrow is tomorrow, day after we have a one day introductory training. Now in the training we have a, a text written by Candice or Denver and, and the text is not uh, about someone. It's, uh, it's a text that evokes that recognition of open intelligence. So when you read the text, you say, wow, it's amazing. I mean, I said that, I don't know what will you say, but for me, it was just completely um, beautiful and true. Just you read the words of true. 
and you want to, to read and to know that about yourself and you know that about yourself instinctively. And then the training is so powerful because you can just hear, you can read the text and then you have shares of the trainers and you can ask questions and you gain confidence immediately in the power of open intelligence.